Level 6 grade D equations. Um, linear equations are ones where you have an x with no power next to it. So um, these two equations are typical grade D questions, grade level 6 questions, where you either have a bracket um, or you have x's on both sides. And then this one I've actually combined the two. Now technically that tends to be um, assessed as a level 7 or grade uh, sorry, level yeah, level seven grade C question, uh, but it's using two level six skills in one go. So when I see a bracket question, standard response is to multiply out the bracket five. This means five times x plus three, five lots of x plus three. So to multiply out this bracket, I do five lots of x, which is five x, and I do five lots of plus three, which is plus fifteen, and they equal seventeen. Stays the same. Now my next step is to manipulate this side so that I have the x on its own. So I'm going to look at inverses. And I've got two two operations in here. I've got 5 times x, 5x, and plus 15. Now, we always deal with the add and subtracting first. We'll get that over to the other side. So the inverse of plus 15 is take away 15. So that gives me 5x. I've taken the 15 away from this side. I've taken 15 away from that side to give me 2. And then this is 5 times x. The inverse of 5 times is divide by 5. So I'm going to divide both sides by 5. 5 divided by 5 is 1, so that just gives me x on its own. One lot of x and two fifths on this side. You can leave it as a fraction. I would like to leave it as a fraction, but most people get upset with that. So that's the same as 0 0.4. Okay, one with x is on both sides. And uh, the classic thing here to do first is to... Um, remove the smaller amount of x to the other side. So I've got 5x and 2x. If I remove the 2x by taking it away and I do the same thing to the other side to balance the equation so this is plus 2x you don't see the plus there normally so to undo it I take it away. 5x take away 2x is 3x and I've immediately left this as a much simpler equation. That's minus 9, that minus stays with the 9. You must keep the sign that's in front of things with it. So now we're at uh, a lower level of question. We've got plus 3, so I subtract 3. Always doing inverses, so 3x and doing the same to both sides. Nine, minus 9 take away 3 is going to be minus 12. And then to undo times by 3, I'm going to divide by 3. And that gives me uh, minus 12 divided by 3 is minus 4. 3 divided by 3 is just 1x. Now combine them together, so we've got a bracket and x on both sides so I'm going to start by multiplying out the bracket 3 lots of x is 3x 3, 3 lots of minus 6 is minus 18 so that's the bracket multiplied out and that always gives you a mark when you're doing a question if you write it out and get it right and then we've got the x on both sides so remove the x that's the smallest so we're going to take away the x from, that's on this side from both sides 3x minus x is 2x Everything else stays the same on that side. That's disappeared to leave me plus 9. I don't need the plus, so I just put 9. And again, back to a simple equation. Doing the opposites. Adding 18 to both sides gives me 2x. And 18 plus 9 is 27. And divide by the 2 to get x on its own. And 27 over 2, half 27 is going to be 13.5 or 13 and a half. 